Hello? I'm on? I'm on? Okay. Hello, this is Sonora Larson, aka Snuggy Fartson in the aesthetics world. Um, I was previously contacted before the filming of Liz Appleby's um, special report on John Carlisle and Aesthetics Right Watch. She tried to reach me for comment. I was unavailable because I was picking out Antony's tux for our wedding. It takes place in July at the U of Chicago uh, mess hall, so more details to come. But the questions Liz asked me were one, I love you. I love you too. Number two, why did you rejoin PA? I wanted to see my content. I missed it. It was good. I was very surprised at how good, you know, and then we came a discussion with William about how, um, how traction is gained and, you know, what we want for future content in the aesthetics realm, um, or the, uh, internation, as I like to call it. Um, so what did I do to deserve PA execution once again? Well, obviously there was the first coup, then the second coup, then... I rejoined about a week ago with the assistance of the secret mod, or two, it's fine. Um, and that was, you know, really just to see what was going on. I wanted to know. It's like going back to an old house that burned down and, you know, look in and see that it's a brand new riverside loft, like everything else these days. Um, and then I started shitposting a bit. Not really shitposting, it was actually pretty fucking good content. Fuck you, PA mods. Aside from, like, car and Taminate added, yeah, but, um, yeah. I think it was the fact that I thought everything had to have a trigger warning, because, you know, I haven't been in PA since all that jazz happened. But, uh, yeah, so I said trigger warning, sarcastic mod hate, uh, about a meme that I made about Harold Chen, and then, whoops. There goes Snug. And then I rejoined after that with the help of Cece to see my content and then somebody saw that I was there and they banned me. Typical. I, I felt a little hurt after that. That's another one of her questions. How did I feel about that? It was really just, you know, like, what does this become? Seriously? Like, me, me, me. Yeah. Okay, so the next round of questions is, what's the deal with Alan? Alan joined the aesthetics groups, I don't know when. Um, he did not really ever do the typical aesthetic entrance exam, which is posting about how you secretly have a crush on one of us, and then we're like, hey, you're cool too, be our friend, be funny with us. That never happened. By the way, this is yarn and a knitting needle. It's a microphone. Shh. Um, so yeah, he, he immediately became very antagonistic and he claims to have stopped. I don't really see it. I got angry with him. He doesn't take criticism well. I don't also take criticism well. I got really angry. I'm like hormonal as heck right now. And, um, <laughs> So yeah, I blocked him, and now apparently I didn't know I was not allowed in the void, but apparently I'm not allowed in the void anymore, like I'm not wanted there, that's what Liz says. So that happened. And then, what do I see for the future of the aesthetics world? Obviously the ideal would be that we all lose our human forms and become strictly URL beings. I don't know how that would happen. I have to find a programmer to allow that. I don't know, my dad knows some software people. I'll, I'm working on it. But more realistically, I think that we need to decide something. Do we need to decide a couple of things? Do we want to include more people in this? Is are we being too harsh. But the thing is, is that we've created a community here. Here. In the cloud. A cloud community. Um, that has really become something special for a lot of us. And, you know, it's hard to allow people to join that. So that's something we need to think about. Another thing is really, do we want to kill PPAA? Not as in, like, in this group, but, like, I don't know, 
just kind of like we have a lot of these very specific groups and obviously popularity is going to fluctuate within all of them but are we just going to allow that to flow or do we want to do something to create a more centralized group also group chats is kind of difficult because we're all so funny and i feel like a lot of content goes there but that's my opinion but i still love them and i love all of you guys and this has been a special report with me tune in next week for secret details about the first ever estate wedding. Signing off. If I can.